Howdy, it's been a busy summer. Uh, hello everyone, welcome, welcome back to the channel. I just wanted to do a little update video, tell you how I'm doing. Um, in the background, what you're seeing is uh, a little bit of video I filmed of me modifying my car at the beginning of summer. And I uh, basically took out the back seats and put in a shelf that also acts as a bed. Um, this allows me to carry around all of my gig equipment and occasionally if I'm on the road and I store all of my stuff in a green room or whatever, and I'm doing a multi-day multi gig, I get to sleep in my car and, and, and be a little bit more comfortable than I would be um, if I was just sleeping in my car in the seat. Um, now you might be asking yourself, well, why don't you shell out $200 on a hotel? Uh, that's not in my budget. So yeah, summer's officially over and I will be having more free time in the future, which means more videos are coming very shortly. And what are they going to be about? Well, I got a whole list of top tutorials that I'm going to be doing, as well as I'll be modifying a new top made out of TPU. So it's a 3D printed top created by Christopher Neff. Uh, we're going to be painting it. And I'm doing some research on what's the best paints to use for a hydrophobic material such as TPU. But um, I, I, I have, I'm, I'm optimistic. I'm optimistic about it. I'm also working with a new clown in town. His name is Rama. Um, we're putting together a flower pot routine, and right now, I, if you've seen my DIY flower pot video, uh, we're using those pots that are like four years old. They're getting cracked a little bit. So I'll be updating those pots. I'll be making, getting some new ones, and we're gonna be experimenting with different sizes, seeing what works best. Right now, the goal is to have the act ready by mid-October. Uh, perform it, record it, and then ship that recording off to the Poconos Juggling Festival, um, or Turbo Fest even. Oh man, that would be sweet. Now there is a flower pot act that already exists. We are trying to be mindful of that and make something that is completely different. And I'm really excited to work with Raman on this because it's just, it's perfect. He's perfect. <laughs> um, we're perfect. Uh, so yeah, very excited. Finally, the last project we're doing is uh, making a four-legged stilt walking costume based off of the Slavic legend of the Leshy. So it's basically a wood spirit. It's gonna be all viney, mossy, sticky. Um, and the goal is to make it scary in the dark, but more kind of bushy and friendly in the daytime. Now, why are we trying to hit this aesthetic? Well. We wanted to work with haunted houses, but we also wanted to work with like corporate events. And there are a couple companies that I know in the area that book out these topiary flower people. And I'm trying to make the Leshy work with that crew. That way I can get booked for those companies. So that's what we got going on for the fall. There are some other super secret, top secret projects that I just can't mention, um, but you'll see them. You'll see them in the future. So um, thanks for watching. And thanks everybody for the support. Uh, we just hit 600 subscribers. And while that's not a million, you guys are the best. I love you. All right. Have a good one. Peace out.